Good morning, everybody. My name is Daniel Pello, coming to you here from First Presbyterian Church in Covington, Virginia. Starting out this Sunday morning with a reading from Advent and Christmas Wisdom by Henry Nowen. The Coming of the Lord. It is Advent again. In his sermon this morning, Oscar Uzan said, Be alert, be alert, so that you will be able to recognize your Lord and your husband, your wife, your parents, your children, your friends, your teachers, but also in all that you read in the daily papers. The Lord is coming, always coming. Be alert to his coming. When you have ears to hear and eyes to see, you will recognize him at any moment of your life. Life is Advent. Life is recognizing the coming of the Lord. That's our reading by Henry Nowen, and now for our scripture reading together from Mark chapter 13, verse 32 through verse 36. But about that day or hour no one knows, neither the angels in heaven nor the Son, but only the Father. Beware, keep alert, for you do not know when the time will come. It is like a man going on a journey, when he leaves home and puts his slaves in charge, each with his work, and commands the doorkeeper to be on the watch. Therefore, keep awake, for you do not know when the master of the house will come, in the evening or at midnight, or at cock crow, or at dawn, or else he may find you asleep when he comes suddenly. That's our scripture reading from Mark, and if you will, please join me in a time together in prayer. Let us now pray together. O Lord Emmanuel, Prince of Peace, let us be especially alert to your coming during this Advent. As a parent listens for the cry of an infant, as a sailor watches for land, as an astronomer scans the skies, as a doctor watches for signs of returning health, let us be attentive to your arrival. Let not our pride and arrogance blind us and put us to sleep. Give us the endurance to be true watchers of the night as we journey through this Advent. Amen. <clears throat> and now for our Advent action today. We are in a state of readiness when we wait in wisdom like the wise virgins of the parable. Get up 15 minutes early or retire 15 minutes later in order to devote time to watchful waiting and prayer. And that is our Advent action. Hope to see you all here tomorrow morning as well. Hope you all have a wonderful and blessed Sunday today. Make sure to tune to our worship service if you're able uh, at 11 a.m. as well today. See you here tomorrow. <laughs>